Let's talk about lithium batteries in cold weather. This is a Tim got 300 amp hour, 12 volt battery. People don't realize that you're not supposed to charge a lithium battery when it is below freezing. It can actually damage the cells inside. Affordable lithium batteries have become a staple in things like RVs, solar installation, and golf carts. Now this might not seem like a big deal, but if you leave your golf cart or your camper plugged in, then it has a constant inflow of current to that battery. Now a good lithium battery will have a low temperature cutoff, meaning that it won't allow the charge if the internal temperature of the battery is too low. Now a better lithium battery will heat itself. There's a little electric blanket inside and when the internal temperature is too low, it's going to apply the charging voltage to that blanket heat up the internal temperature of those cells so that the battery can be charged. And this is an extremely handy feature to have. So this battery has it, let's test it. We are juiced up. Yes, I know this is not a lithium charger. My 12 volt lithium charger is currently tied up. So let's see how we're doing. Okay, so the internal temperature, 30.2. Let's see how long it takes. So we're at nine minutes and 40 seconds. Let's check in on our battery. We have one more degree to go until that is above 32. Let's keep watching. So something cool just happened. We're just over 40 minutes and check it out. So the internal temperature of the battery rose to 33.2 degrees and we are now dumping voltage into the battery instead of the electric blanket. It's actually really cool. I've never had the chance to test a self-heating feature in a lithium battery. It's nice to see it working. I've definitely killed a lithium battery in the winter. So leave me a comment. Tell me, is this something you would use? Let me know.